<laughs> hey guys, today is the big day. I say that because I have this box right here. Inside of it is the VSM2, aka the mid satellite, aka the mid side extension, aka I'm broke. The package just arrived, a short unboxing. I want to install the VSM2 in the rack. Let's hope that everything will go well so I can be able to let you in on a short little demo. I'm just uh, sharing my joy. I don't know if you can tell, but I am really, really excited about this piece of gear. <laughs> I will probably have a couple of B-roll shots so you can see the connections, the faceplate. After that, it's time to put this beast in the rack, recable everything, test this bad boy out. Talk to you soon. Everything is working just fine. I want to give you just a taste of the VSM2. I will have plenty of videos uh, on the unit, but today let's run some audio through it and let's see what happens. I have a session from uh, Sanito, a simple track, just bass, drums and vocals. Let's run that through VSM2. Let's play with all its feature and see what's the first impression. Versuch, 
On insert 1 I have the music cue and impressor, on insert 2 I have a longer chain, I have the massive passive envelope, I have the distressor, the deressor and I also have the Dion from West Audio and I can add those two chains really easy with the inserts on the VSM2. Same thing, we can go mid side or left right. On insert one we have dry wet so parallel compression is available. Insert two again mid side left right. Also we have something really cool we can monitor the mids or the sides just like So I can hear exactly what I'm doing if I do mid-side processing. The big knob on top when in left right is a pan so we can correct poorly balanced uh, tracks. But when in mid-side we can play with the width of the song. Something that you can use to fix problems or something that you can use to enhance. What I want to do now is showcase what you can do with the, the inserts. For example, insert one, music cue on. Let's add some top end to the sides. I can also add the impressor. Again, we are in mid side, so I can process the, the sides. So I can make the sides pump in a really cool uh, way. On uh, insert tool, like I said, I have the massive passive. I can use that again in mid side. As you can see, I have a distressor that's on the left channel. So that means when I use it in mid side, I can use it on the 
mono channel which is great for processing drums or other things or even full mixes. I've also added the envelope to the sides, really adding a lot of sustain, bringing that room back. What I'm doing is just purely experimental and over the top, but you can clearly see the options I will have with the mix satellite. This was just a short taste of the VSM2. I will have tons of videos on uh, the unit. See you guys really, really soon. Cheers.